all right guys what is up arif here um today i'm gonna do uh five records that i picked up from my uh, collection that uh this is gonna be a something like a weekly uh update um of my collection i pick five records on uh every video so uh let's just start it off with uh this week uh picks so uh the first one i love this band so much um they are fucking amazing really goddamn intense live so um uh, most of you guys know as some of you guys don't know don't really know this band this is uh trap them not sure if you guys can see that this album is freaking amazing this is probably the first uh album i've i listened to them um I'm not sh sure why is it why I forgot why it's called though but uh <laughs> it's really fucking amazing. I think it's seizures. Um the album title is seizures but um really fucking amazing album man. I mean you guys should check them out. Every re releases they put out is just f phenomenal. Um I love um kind of a like hardcore metal kind of uh, feel to it. Um very very hm2 heavy band <laughs> so uh this is the uh the gatefold it's a triple gatefold it's freaking crazy um let me just try to open all three of them pretty sick huh amazing amazing band um i wish to uh share the same stage with these guys because i've never seen them live before so uh i never met them guys before so uh, i hope hopefully in the future i i get to tour um one of the dates or maybe tour with them that would be insane this is the uh inner sleeve there you go i got this on uh gray with a little bit of swirl going on Man, this camera is too fucking bright. I'm not sure if you guys can see that though. You guys can see that, right? Yeah. So, uh, yep. This is, uh, do check them out. Trap them is fucking amazing band. Uh, if you're into hardcore, um, metal. And, um, I don't know. It's just plain fucking heavy. Although the songwriting is is simple straight to the point in your face that's what i love about this uh extreme music um hardcore metal man i i've been <sighs> one of the reason i dig hardcore metal is because of this fucking band trap them is fucking amazing and you have the chance to check them out on youtube live um i mean their live videos on youtube better check them out because pretty fucking intense especially the vocalist going ape shit crazy crazy stuff trap them how the fuck you do it yep amazing amazing album all right the next one um is probably one of my one of my favorite bands um total blasting band and not to mention the guitar works is just phenomenal on every record they put out um the band I was talking about is um, Great Link. This is the uh, Amber Grey and Often into in in one record. So pretty fucking amazing. I didn't manage to snack the uh, just the Often and the uh, Amber Grey by itself. I think it's really hard to come by these days. So I I just kind of grab both in one record. That's pretty fucking sweet deal. Um, it's hard to come by though this album because uh they release very very extremely fucking limited copies by uh hydra hits i'm not sure if that label is still exists i'm not too sure maybe uh john can you confirm it with me so uh yep there you go this is the uh the gateful really intense stuff if you are into dark kind of melodic kind uh, insane man it's just i got this on red um one thing i love about great link is that they are freaking relentless especially life the guitarist 
it's just crazy. I um I mean me and my guitarist um in my band um really love their songwriting. Um I mean the drums are just freaking blast all the way but uh the guitar works kind of um I don't know makes it up for everything so it's not that it's not monotonous at all because um freaking amazing amazing band I'm it's sad that they are no longer around um I'm trying my best to push John John Chang which is the vocalist of this band Great Link um not to be an asshole and just continue working on a new record of Great Link because I fucking love this band. This band um, kind of accompanied me during my rough days back in the um, about a few years ago. Um, was having a terrible time and this album kind of comforted me. So uh, cheers man, Great Link fucking rules. Another band that I am really, really fond of is uh, Rotten Sound. Man, this video is bright as shit, right? I gotta adjust the uh, brightness, but you guys can see this is uh, Rotten Sound Cycles. Uh, I'm not gonna open this up because it's still sealed, and I will open it when I have my own house. So, uh, th this is the back. Rotten Sound again, fucking relentless grindcore. Um, HM2 heavy, um, really fucking heavy. You guys should check this album out. I mean, check all of their albums. It's just freaking amazing, man. This is bright as fuck. So uh, I'm sorry if it doesn't really look that clear on video, but you get the point. Um, this album is called Cycles. Um, one of their one of I can can I say it's a rare LP I I'm I'm not too sure if it's rare or not because I it's really tough for me to get a hold of this piece and a friend of mine Mr. Roy from Singapore kind of hooked me up with this one so uh, thanks man really means a lot uh, Rotten Sound fucking amazing band um, I've we've not toured with Rotten Sound before but we've played a show uh, a few shows uh with nasum and i get to meet uh Keio from rotten sound which which is the vocalist um, really nice guy really stand up guy love this fucking band man relentless grindcore ah all right this one is a a very memorable um record and um this band introduced me power violence which is um I'm a huge fan of again hardcore uh punk trash kind of mixed into one um really fast band for for back in the day it's really fucking amazing spares anyone doesn't know spares is uh, I don't know why where were you and um if you have not listened to spares just check them out I know most of uh the new listeners who are really into uh extreme music doesn't really appreciate the rawness of uh the the recording quality back in the day but y y you just got to feel the intensity of this band so um it's that point of era 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 or era i know <laughs> it's that point of uh, that point of year this band is one of the fastest i've i've ever heard and they are really raw and groovy as well that's the most important thing you, you can't just have blast all the way but without any grooves it, it tends to get very monotonous but this guy this band has i don't know it, they have character and i really appreciate into uh what they have done uh on all of their releases um man i mean l look at one of the song titles wwf rematch at the cow palace that's one of the titles man so um let me just uh like uh urinal cake um raging hate fear and flower power violence i mean you guys should understand what what kind of uh um theme they are going to just don't give a fuck just 
write songs if the title sounds stupid so fuck it just put it out and all that but their music is freaking amazing you guys should check this out not only this uh la revancha album but other albums like crush kill destroy such a classic do check them out fucking killer band i hope they reform but i'm not too sure this band is dead by the way so hoping for the best all right last but not least this is the fifth record i'm gonna show you guys i have to say my favorite grindcore band there's too many grindcore bands that i that i love so much but this band nasum we get to tour with these guys um sadly not with the original members the only original members was uh the drummer and i'm we are fortunate enough to be touring with them for a few for a few dates in in europe back in i'm not too sure which year was it but yeah they are freaking amazing every fucking night so um uh even though they are not the original members but they are members from rotten sound victims um i'm not too sure one more band was it misery index i'm not too sure but uh killer guys i gotta thank those guys who uh did the tour because um in respect to misco um it's a final tour of uh nasum and i am really really glad to be a part of that tour so um this is nasum grind finale um this is still sealed i'm not gonna open this up because there's four goddamn LPs in here and it's waste a goddamn ton. Um, all of these are from their demos, early stuff, demos, EPs and all that good stuff. So um, it's by uh, um, Unrest Records. Really cool. Um, it's really fucking raw. Not, this LP is not for everyone. If anyone appreciates raw kind of acceptable kind of raw uh recordings is good you can see how the band progresses from uh raw to to kind of clean production kind of little bit of uh muddy uh recordings and all that really really nice if you guys aren't aware of nasu please check them out they are no longer active um but hopefully I don't know if they are gonna reform i have no idea because the drummer has another band called cold worker if i'm not mistaken was it cold worker yeah so uh do check them out nasum fucking killer band so yeah that's about it guys Th those are my five picks for this week i'm gonna uh, choose another five uh next week or whenever i have the free time this is my first video so uh, i'm still trying to get used to this um talking to myself kind of bullshit but uh yep that's about it from me um i catch you guys on the next video peace